This is Steve, best known for bronze medal 1988 Seoul Olympics and a collection of other shrapnel that we don't really need to go into. This is James. <laughs> he used to be an uh, Olympic rower and he's got two quarters of Olympic gold medals for Great Britain. Does that make a half? Yeah. <laughs> yes. A good half. <laughs> who was, I'd who say. Who was. Who, who still is. <laughs> <laughs> who was, I'd say that. <laughs> right and now, is. if we raced, it might be me. <laughs> from representing Britain at sculling and rowing on both sides of the boat, aside from a bullion of his own, I'd, uh, I'd have to say him. Well, I'd have to say me as well, <laughs> only because that, uh, James retired too early. He could have gone on a bit longer and won a few gold medals. Oh, I think, I think it was you. I think it was me. When Steve was at his, at his peak, not that you weren't your peak when they we didn't, were rowing, they, they didn't have rowing machines. It was, it was Who held the world record on the uh, ergo, and I did, for 20 minutes, between heats at the World Championships of the, the Indoors. Good work. About what? <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> I think we're probably pretty even on that. If it's now, it'll be James. If it's about uh, the history of the sport, it'll probably be me. A week ago, I'd have held up my name here but I was on Question of Sport, a film Question of Sport just before coming out and I got all four rowing questions wrong. Of all the time of training, I don't remember you putting an album on. You used to moan about mine. I'm going to show Steve for never revealing his hand. It's got to be James because <laughs> that uh, he used to have his uh, headphones on but we used to have to listen to his music as well because he'd have it so loud that it'd be really really annoying. You got more than one word? I don't have one word. Oh, see, I've got thank you. Oh, there you go. That's oh, it. Uh, he's, he's answered it then. Obrigado. That's my, my thank you has done it. Easy one. He has been in residence every morning, but I'm not sure if he's there from the night before. I have to get there first because James pinches all the food. So uh, uh, if you want watermelon, get there before James. 